Hi there, and welcome to this day in history, May 9th. May 9th is the 129th day of the year in the Gregorian calendar, 130th in leap years, with 236 days remaining to the end of the year. Today's word is splanknik. Splanknik is an adjective that means of or relating to internal organs or viscera. It comes to us from Greek, earliest documented use, 1694. I'd like to take a moment to mention that links to my research are included in the show notes. I encourage you to go ahead and click that like button. Consider subscribing if you haven't already, and feel free to share this video with others, a link in your email, messaging, or social media. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. And with that, we're going to start in the year 1386, when on May 9th, England and Portugal ratified their alliance with the signing of the Treaty of Windsor, making it the oldest diplomatic alliance in the world, which is still in force. Have you ever seen a Punch and Judy show? Those are puppet shows. Well, on May 9th, 1662, the figure who later became Mr. Punch made his first recorded appearance in England. On May 9th, 1877, an 8.8 .8 earthquake off the coast of Peru killed more than 2,500 people, including some as far away as Hawaii and Japan. Buffalo Bill Cody's Wild West show opened in London on May 9th, 1887. Australia opened its first national parliament in Melbourne on May 9, 1901. This is the birthday of American journalist and media personality Mike Wallace, born May 9, 1918. He lived to the age of 93. And on May 9, 1927, the old parliament house, Canberra, officially opened after parliament's relocation from Melbourne to the new capital, Canberra. This is the birthday of American actress Candace Bergen, born May 9, 1946. Also the birthday of American singer-songwriter and pianist Billy Joel, born May 9, 1947. Rainier III, and I mean his, his birth certificate name is about this long, but we call him Rainier III, became the Prince of Monaco on May 9, 1949. He ruled until his death in 2005, 2005. He may be best known to most folks for having married the American actress Grace Kelly, but he had initiated reforms to Monaco's constitution and expanded the principality's economy from its traditional casino gambling base to its current tax haven role. Alfred Hitchcock's film Vertigo premiered in San Francisco on May 9, 1958. This is the birthday of American baseball player and coach and Hall of Famer, Tony Gwynn, born May 9, 1960. He played 20 seasons for the San Diego Padres and was inducted into the National Baseball Hall of Fame in 2007. Sadly, he passed away in 2014 at the age of 54. On May 9, 1960, the Food and Drug Administration commonly known as FDA, approved the world's first commercially produced birth control pill, known as Innovid 10, made by the G.D. Cyril Company of Chicago, Illinois. And in yet more <laughs> Australian Parliament news, the new Parliament House in Canberra officially opened on May 9, 1988. And it seems like them Aussies are all about May 9th. <laughs> anyway, I think that's going to do it for us today. I hope that the background noises weren't too much. It uh, was dead quiet when I came out here. <laughs> I think a lot of people are out of town for Mother's Day this weekend. Anyway, I hope you learned something that you didn't know before. I know I sure did. And as always, links to my research are included in the show notes. Thank images are retrieved from Bing Images, either public domain or licensed free to use and share. I think the correct terminology is free to share and use. Our lovely outro music is Divine Life Society by Jesse Gallagher from YouTube Music Library, and there's a link to his channel in the show notes. 
Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a like. Be sure and subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. And remember that you can share this video with others with the link in your email messaging or social media. Thanks again and I'll see you next time. changing it up.